that's the bad part, Tom. Show, show the good part. All of this part is the good part. They haven't. They, ha they don't have to work on the wheels. They're just doing the body work. Wait, so, we're not. We're not keeping the wheels. I, I you can keep them. I mean, I figured we'd bring them inside, <laughs> maybe hang them on the walls. I thought the wheels were the best day. part of the car. So it is update time for our 1970 Nova project. We are at DLS Paints, and they have taken on this this Nova. You know, we were trying all these different shops and everyone was like, we don't want to do an old car. Our old cars are the worst. We only do insurance work and um, nobody was excited about it. And then Randy and Rudy contacted me and they were like, hey, you know, we're following your project. We'd be willing to take this on. We got a paint shop. We, we do a lot of classic Chevys. You can see they, they do. were they were foolish enough to help us. Yeah, but they weren't lying. They do a lot of classic. By the way, there they, they are. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, so we brought the Nova uh, maybe just about a month ago. I it think. hasn't been very long. It hasn't been very long. And they have been knocking it out. It's actually pretty incredible. Let's do a quick walk and then we'll drag them on here and I will make them tell us exactly what they've had to deal with. All right. But, you guys can probably remember what this car looked like. Actually, I bet Tom can put a photo in from our previous. Yeah, if you remember this hood, uh, I will show you the before <laughs> and now the after. And this is the original uh, Chevy Nova SS hood, which they have repaired unbelievably in the front here this is all caved in and uh that was also caved in but it looks pretty good i, I mean, mean you could have just got fiberglass Aww. cowl hood no we're not doing the fiberglass cowl hood <laughs> 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 and then uh, there were some other issues it had uh, this, <clears throat> the belt molding which they've welded up all the holes because uh against my better judgment we're not using the molding yeah I <sighs> I appreciate everyone who voted with me when we did the, do we put the molding back on the car or not poll. Yeah. The answer is no, yeah. no molding. No, no molding on this one. If it was my own car, we would put molding on. And uh, this quarter panel was atrocious before. It's looking uh, savable now. The tail panel was also uh, <laughs> really bad. And they're working on it now, beating it back into submission here. They've done an incredible job. Uh, what else was there? Oh, there was uh, a rust hole up here where the, where the seam is. And that, uh, I'll let the guys tell you about that, but that was uh, <laughs> expanded into a much bigger project <laughs> than it should have been. Um, there was also your repair that we did uh, oh, yeah. let's, the let's, bottom. How let's showcase my fender repairs. Yeah, They're looking pretty good, huh? <laughs> could be a body man. Sure. Yeah. Um, <laughs> right now the body men are laughing at me. Well, I just remember how much work that was, and you look at it compared to the rest of the car, and it's like this much space. Oh, yeah. It was like six inches of work, and it took us multiple days, and then they've knocked all of the rest of this out in a month. I mean, maybe we should talk to them. Let's do that. They're better at it than we are, so let's see what the, they have to say. All right, we've got Randy, we've got Rudy. Hey. hey. It's DLS Paints. Um, before we talk about what my car has done to you. <laughs> it ran me over. Sorry, man. Um, it didn't really. I mean, I think It's it what did. happens with working with Nova. <laughs> it's this a hazard why, to the job. This is why nobody yeah. wants to work with Nova. Yeah. Um, tell me a little bit about the paint shop. Like, how long have you guys been working? What made you want to do paint and body? I mean, you're you're young guys, oh, you know? You. This isn't thank like a old, you know, old guy thing. Yeah, but we're being passed down skills from uh, the old school guys, you know, like uh, his dad and uh, yeah. Our uncle, uh, 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 Rafa, Rafa, he's always here. Um, he's the one that actually uh, guided us to a lot of the process, yeah. you know, so he's giving us uh, his knowledge. So, and he works on high-end cars, so. Yeah. <laughs> Has our Nova been the worst thing that's come into the shop? Um, you can so be far, So far, yeah. <laughs> we've, had some, we've had some rots and some issues on there, but uh, nothing that we didn't expect, you know, working with an old car, especially, you know. 
I mean, yeah. we were really smug when we dropped it off. We were like, no, man, we got this thing clean. Yeah. All you got to do is just pull this one <laughs> panel out. It's a little dented in the back. Yeah, that's why we always laugh. We're always like, people's like, they're ready to go to paint. I'm like, <laughs> if I drop paint, then you're going to, you know, you're going to see little things. So, yeah, we always go through it, find the things that, that are missed. And, you know, it's, 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 a, it's a fun process finding them out. Yeah. When, um, when people bring cars in, you know, I mean, we, we did do our best to at least bring it to you mostly taken apart. Yeah, that, right? that helped, yeah, because the trim on old school cars, the, that's the worst. He'll tell you, I mean, I yeah. mean, shit, taking stuff off is just, it's, uh, it's, it's old so school. It's so nerve-wracking once you have to put everything Especially back. Especially with the rust and all that, that's what makes it kind of complicated, but yeah. But you guys brought it without that, so we're like... That's half the time. <laughs> yeah. See, that's the one benefit yeah. of getting a car from a mechanic. It's like, at least we brought it to you, like, somewhat clean. Yeah. There weren't any rats or anything no, in it, no, right? No, that, uh, there's nothing to, like, really, you know, to, like, baby or anything like that. I mean, we cover the dash, all that, once we drop primer and all that. But other than that, I mean, it's ready to, ready to be worked on, so, yeah. So if, uh, if I can force you to yeah. walk around the car a little bit, <laughs> let's start at the front. Let's go over to this hood. Oh, yeah. And let's talk about it a little. So this was Frankenstein when we first saw it. It was all, it was a monster. It was just tore up. But uh, what we did was uh, we were able to weld pieces onto, we used old school tricks uh, that Rafa taught us. Uh, welded a piece right here, started pulling up just with a slide hammer. Um, worked it all out, shrinked it back and shaped it. And once we were able to do that, we were able to, um, Put a little bit of a skin coat of Bondo and, you know, here we are. It, it looks amazing. I mean, because it's, it's not just like a flat panel. you got to, like, bring that little spine oh, yeah. up. And yeah, then like the artwork. strength. Yeah, because this is the strength here. So once, once, you, um, once you fix this, all this gets hardened, you know. Because so, you guys had a little bit of flop, but everything is pretty, pretty solid now. Yeah. You know, so. Was it, I mean, is any of it fun, like, like slide hammer and stuff? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. I can't pick it up, but Caesar, can you, can you pick it up, Luke? Check it out. Yeah. Um, that's the funnest part, because you get to beat metal. Who doesn't <laughs> like to, uh, you know, take their little... Look at that monster. Yeah. So we were able to weld that. We made a custom piece, then yeah. ding it out. Yeah. Yeah. And then you were talking about shrinking. What does that mean? Like, when you start pulling it out, it's sort of like when you're stretching a t-shirt over your head yeah. or something, right? Yeah, so it starts, it starts pulling, so you gotta, you gotta make sure, you gotta massage the metal, make sure it goes back to where it's originally supposed to be, kind of, you know, flat out. And do you do that yeah. with, like, a hammer and a dolly? Yeah, we had dollies. Uh, we, used, uh, we used a variety of hammers, actually. Um, there's so many, it's just, we just go through them. Whichever <laughs> one works at that moment that I see a spot, especially like that. But uh, always the small hammers are the, the greatest. It looks, yeah. it looks so good. It's really cool to see it yeah. sort of back in shape because it was, was sort of like punched in. Yeah. Then this line here, this line was all the way, it was buckled in. So what we did, we took the dolly here and then we took the dolly, straightened all this out. Um, I, oh, sorry. I took it all here, worked it all out. Actually, got this whole line to come out pretty good, and then we uh, we got dropped the skin coat of Bondo. Um, we still, as you can see, we still got some sanding to do, but it's almost there, you know. So, yeah. was the hood the hardest part, or was it the, was? And so then the tail panel, I assume, is like second hardest. Yeah. So the tail, the okay. So it hit us with a surprise because there was lead here before. So like uh, uh, the rust, the rust oh, panel the I have here, yeah. So I had a, so I guess here at one point or another it had it had been used lead and repaired with lead. So once we started, I cut it out right, and then once we went to weld, everything just started dripping. All the lead <laughs> started dripping. Like we we're like, what's going on here? The car is melting. <laughs> you know, it's just yeah. And then uh, what we did was just we cleaned off all the lead, and then uh, welded the piece. So, I mean, now you can't even tell. So, same thing on the other side. It was a little bit rotten, so we had to just, you know. At least you knew on the second side that you were going to be dealing with. Oh, that. yeah. Yeah, we got some patches done, all that. Um, this here was one of the worst, uh, I would say third worst. It was kind of, it was buckled in. It had a hit here before. Um, you guys can see here. There was a buckle here at one point or another, so. Uh, look at that. So it's yeah, sorry. 
So there's a buckle here. So there was an accident. That's how we can tell there was an accident before. So that's how we knew this had gone in, kind of, kind of gone in. So what we did is we worked it off from the back, uh, beat it all out. Dolly worked this whole um, flat panel here, and we did our best to get it straightened out. And now, oh, we actually we measured the light. The light fits good, um, so it is, it's gonna sit. It's gonna sit nice. Right, because yeah. like one of the things that's difficult when you're working on an area like this is that it it's not enough for it to just look good yeah it has to actually fit the pieces that go back in yeah. right like the bumper and everything you could have it all looking straight and then you start to put the bumper on and realize yeah. like ah it's like a quarter it's inch too are. low yeah. or something fit and function you know it's gotta it's gotta fit and function well so I, we don't want the water getting in there yeah. um so yeah that's one of the this is like the art part you know gotta <laughs> massage it nice and it's amazing. Take it your looks time. so good. I, it's really exciting. I, it's exciting for us too. I mean, because we love working on these type of cars. You know, it was like always as kids. You know, you just want to work on old school rods. You know, yeah. so do you feel yeah. like you're building like model cars? Like, yeah, like, yeah. Full size. Yeah. Everyone comes in. They're like, what? First, they'll <laughs> mispronounce what it is, or like they'll name it something else, and then we'll tell them it's a Nova. Yeah. You know, but everyone's always loved these kind of cars. So, yeah. So it's been fun. Everyone that comes and helps us. They, they 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 enjoy it. We're building memories, you know. So yeah. <laughs> we'll send you a Christmas card yeah. here. Yeah. Yeah. How so. many guys have you got working on the shop? In the shop? Uh, so it's been four of us. Been four of us just uh, banging it out every day. Um, but then we have friends that want to learn, so they'll come help us. So everyone, shout out to everyone that comes out. Oh, that's yeah. rad. Yeah. So. Give us a give us a quickie overview of, of some of the other projects that are in here. Are these like customer projects? Are they yeah. your guys' cars? What's happening here? Yeah, like this 54 uh, Bel Air came in uh, came in Thursday. Um, this one's getting repainted. Um, basically, all trim off, um, windows, everything. We're gonna spray this one. It's gonna be a candy apple. Mm -hmm. So this will be this will be show car ish, you know. That's exciting. Uh, have, you, have you guys sprayed a candy before? Uh, we sprayed pearls, yeah. So this will be the first candy I can say, yeah. Yeah, we shot burgundies and all that, but this one's going to be fun. Yeah. Yeah. We love three stages, so. Yeah, yeah that's really, really cool. And then, yeah. you, you know, you got some new car stuff? or Yeah, we got our JDMs because, yeah. you know, we, uh, that's where we come from, you know, building uh, four cylinders all the time. <laughs> Is that, is that like your own? That's how we own? started, mm -hmm. uh, Subarus and all that. We used to build uh, swap engines and do everything on the on the curb uh, at his mom's house. <laughs> yeah, every, literally on the curbside. Oh, the neighbors must have loved you. Yeah, yeah. Well, everyone, we worked on their cars, so no one could complain. So, <laughs> yeah. And then this is looking pretty yeah, much Yeah, there's another customer. Go, huh? Customer had this vision. I mean, he chose color, trim. I mean... He he basically told us what to do. We went with it, and it came out it came out really nice to us. So um, this one also had like patches done on the pillars, um, but the work has been it's been done. You can't even tell. <laughs> so <laughs> that's the fun part because then we're like, yes, you can, you yeah. can, you know, satisfying. Oh um, gosh, I bet, yeah. yeah. And you can like look at it and be like, I did that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So what's next on our Nova? So next on the Nova is, uh, is going to get primered one more time. Um, we still got body work to do. If you can see, there's a dent down there we got to pull out underneath the door. Yeah, right there. So that one's got to be pulled out. Um, the roof is almost there. So what will happen now is um, primer the whole car again. And then once we primer it all, we'll go 320 it. And then we'll see if any defects come out. And then we'll be set, you know. And then we'll be ready to... Um, start thinking about paint. Yeah, so yeah. then we just got to figure out exactly what color we're going That's with. That's it, yeah, yeah. So we'll give you a few samples, that way we're yeah. on the right page. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. you know, just whatever you got left over. Yeah. Half, half green and half candy. Yeah, apple. we'll mix them up, yeah. We can make a cocktail. Yeah. Um, <laughs> awesome. All right, well, it's time. You guys need to give a plug. So um, first of all, we're, we're in Southern California. We're kind of in the San Fernando Valley area. Yes, um, some valley. Uh, what kind of projects are you 
you know, what do you want people to bring to you, and how do they get a hold of you, and where do they follow you online? Uh, so you can follow us on Instagram, DLS Paints. Um, we're on, on Facebook as well. Facebook. We're on TikTok also. Yeah. As DLS Paints. How hip are you? <laughs> We're, we're trying to keep we're with the trends. To, yeah. yeah. But we, what we prefer is uh, old school cars like that because we like to make art, you know, yeah. and um, once these paint jobs leave, we want them to be shown out there on the streets. Um, but we'll take, uh, we'll take anything, <laughs> you know? Money. I mean, is it Chevy only? Are you willing to do other yeah, we, Chevrolet we, cars? Oh, no, we, we do. We, we, do them, we do them all. It's just that this Nova brought down one, yeah, this one. one. <laughs> yeah, got another S, uh, C10 right there, ready to go. So, I mean. So bring yeah. them your project, but not till they're done with our Nova yeah. and like six, six other cars that we have to bring them. Yeah. We'll burn them out. The prices will go up, yeah. but you should still come visit them. They yeah. can practice yeah. on our cars. Yeah. <laughs> for sure. Thank Definitely. you guys. This and is thank awesome. you, thank you for uh, taking the, the the chance with this. So. Oh yeah. my God, it's, we appreciate it's really that. fun. And yeah. I've been learning a lot. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much, yeah.